my channel. This is Sky and alam ko sobrang tagal ko nang last na sinabi yon. Kasi ewan ko ba parang sobrang tagal na nang last na video na na-shoot ko and na upload ko sa YouTube. So I'm sorry, alam ko na I said last time, last year actually, that I will be uploading more videos about law school. Pero naging sobrang busy lang guys. Well, for this year, ito ulit yung una kong sit down video. Sobrang daming nangyari last year. As in sobra. Kung baga parang siguro yun yung pinaka pagod na pagod na pagod ako sa law school life ko. But today, I will be giving you an update sa life ko, but since yung life ko is really more on law school than law school is life. More of law school update na lang din siya. Ganun na lang. And, alam ko din na you've been sending me a lot of messages, um, asking me a lot of questions, so I appreciate that na support niya yung channel. Go lang sa 1,000 plus subscribers na tayo, but Again, don't forget to like and subscribe and click that notification bell to get notified whenever I post new videos. And share this video sa mga friends niyo. So, kung gusto niyong malaman ko anong ganap sa buhay ko last year and early this year, please keep on watching. So, paano ko ba sisimulan? Sobrang daming nangyari sa akin last year. The reason na hindi ako nakapag-upload ng videos. Well, sabi ko nga, Last year, sobrang pagod na pagod na pagod ako sa tanang buhay ko sa law school. Yun ang pinakapagod ako talaga. Dahil din, siguro third year kasi ako nung second sem, and then fourth year nung first sem. So lahat yun nangyari last year. But maybe I can start with my internship. So, sa internship ko, just like in college, we also have internship or apprenticeship sa law school. And I was blessed to be part of one of the most, if not the most prestigious May nag-text siya. <laughs> if not the most prestigious law internship program in the country. So, napasok ako sa Office of the Solicitor General. Usually, sa Araliano, they only get one or two students per year. And, ayon, I've met a lot of different law students. Of course, a lot of lawyers, a lot of associate solicitors, and I also met the Solicitor General of the country. So, sobrang dami nangyari. And I can attest na... It's really one of the best internship programs that you can take if you're going to get into law school. Because the on I was taught, or we were taught, how to draft pleadings, more on appellant's brief, ganon, uh, comments, opposition. Okay, so kung bagas sobrang dami namin na tutunan talaga don. But at the same time, we also visited different courts. I was able to go to the Court of Appeals. We were able to witness hearing sa different courts, RPCs. And of course, the Supreme Court. So, sobrang memorable sa akin na OSG. And I've met so many great students doon. And I've also made friends with them, of course. Network, network lang yan. <laughs> but, yun lang siguro masasabi ko. One of the things that I've really learned doon, aside from, you know, drafting pleadings and documents, no? Pahikisama. At the same time, yung networking. Yes! <laughs> networking! <laughs> Open-minded ka ba? <laughs> Hindi, pero... Malaking tulong yung network eh. Dapat marunong kang makisama sa lahat ng klaseng tao. Kasi eventually, sila din yung makakatulong sa'yo in the future. You'll never know, di ba? So, tulong-tulong talaga siya. And yun yung nakita ko sa OSG, sa batchmates ko doon. Even until now, we even have our own group chat. Nagtutulungan kami. Uh, merong iba sa amin na graduate na. Well, ako, uh, graduating na this December. Claiming it. But, um, ayun nga. Sobrang nakita ko yung tulungan. And sabi ko nga, mas gusto ko yung ganun. Kaysa yung sobrang competitive and magkakaaway kayo lahat, ba Hindi, hindi siya makakatulong. And I will be able to show you a few clips then on what happened. May program kami na we had to do a retreat. Parang ganun, different kinds of cases. Sobrang dami. And mind blown ako kasi we were also able to go to different offices of the government like the OJ, ganyan. We're able to talk to different prosecutors. Sobrang ganda ng experience. So, I'll be showing you a few clips now. Enjoy!
ba? Nakapagpa-picture pa kay Dean Jock no? Noong time na yun sa SC. Hey na ho. Yun, yun yung experience ko sa OSG. So, if you want to have a great experience sa internship ninyo, go ahead and apply sa Office of the Scissor... Sol Office of the Solicitor General. Every year naman open yan sila. So, next! Ano ba? After ng internship ko. Yes, uh, I attended the Association of Law Students of the Philippines convention wherein they awarded different students. And I'm so happy na ang dami kong nakilala din dun. But at the same time, thank you sa ALSP for awarding me the Leadership Award. Hindi ko rin and expect actually but thank you so much for appreciating you know what i do and not only myself no but other student leaders so thank you so much ALSP i'll just show you a few clips lang doon kasi sobrang funny naka filipiniana kami and sobrang improvised no filipiniana ko na yan thank you to my guild sa ALFG for being there um congratulations also to Arliano Law Singers and uh of course my guild ALFG Congratulations, guys. Let's just continue serving because that's really the purpose. The main goal is to be able to serve. But here are some clips. Nag drinking session, nag like after party na naka Filipiniana and barongs, diba? Sobrang sayala. So, next one, what else happened to me? Ah! Of course, bar operations. <laughs> Ever since first year, bar ops sa talaga, diba? So, last year, I was the vice chair for academics. Sobrang hirap, grabe. Grabe yung pinagdaanan namin <laughs> sa pag-review ng materials. This year, I'm actually the chairperson of uh, the Bar Operations of Arleano. So, I'm hoping na ma-continue namin yung legacy and uh, matuloy-tuloy namin yung pag-serve sa bar takers natin. But, okay, so ha what happened last year? So, siguro, I'll just show you a few clips now para lang you get a better understanding of what really happened. Ah! Of course, nila kami puro work, no? Meron din kaming play. Charot, hindi. Pero kami, yung Bar Ops Execom members, meron kaming mukbang session. At na-video talaga namin yun. So, panoorin nyo. Kasi kain kami ng kain sa stress. <laughs> Here it is. Enjoy watching.
Well, last year, I was still the team captain of the swimming team. So, I was still the team captain of the But then, of course, sabi ko nga, ang mga ganong klase ng activities, isa yun sa mga breather ng law students. So, if you're going to be a law student, don't be hesitant to join those kinds of activities because it's something that would really make you feel na you're not just a law student, diba? It would make you feel like a normal person. Na you're also enjoying different things and you have your own hobbies, your own interests. Go ahead and join organizations if you can. But of course, you have to be able to prioritize your studies. Yun naman yung importante. So, time management din. Ito pala, isa pang pinaka bonggang Bong katalaga na pagod na nangyari sa akin. Last year, I was also able to go back to becoming a host. Kasi college days. Tsya, nag-host host ako konti before and I enjoy it, diba? So, nabigyan ako ng opportunity to be able to become a host. So, first hosting gig, yung AUSL Idol. Kasi every year, meron kaming ganon na different law students laban-laban sila. Parang American Idol. But last year, the difference lang na nangyari last year was merong ka-partner na professor. May judges, but yung pinakamaraming votes, siya pa rin yung magiging win. It's a fundraising activity, and it's for the bar operations to help our bar takers. So, I was the host there. Sobra enjoy nun. So, I'll show you a few clips lang just for you to get what I mean.
nag-vlog ko, Tay. Oh, nag-vlogger yan, Tay. Famous vlogger ng... Ano yan? Hello! Kai, congrats. Good job. Thank you so much. Thank you, Tatay. Diba? Kalahin mo yun. May ganun pa. May ganun kami. Hindi ko alam ko kung sa Arellano lang yun. Pero we know how to party. We know how to enjoy. Kasi hindi mo pwedeng all the time aral lang. Although... Ngayon graduating dapat ganun. Pero, what I mean is, our school is really amazing when it comes to those kinds of things. Kasi they're very supportive sa mga students nila. And they really want the students to enjoy their law school life. So, so that's the AUSL Idol. That was last year. And it was under the Arellano Law Singers Organization. So, I was the host there. So, second hosting gig. All the way pangalawa. Post bar party. Yun talaga yun eh. Post bar party is one of the biggest parties ever na naattendan ko sa school. <laughs> Isa siya sa mga parties that we look forward to. Kasi that's the time that we make the salubong to our bar takers. Parang last Sunday of the bar exam. Darating sila, kaya sila ng bus ng school, and then we will welcome them sa gates na Araliano and then cheer them on. Show them our support. And of course, meron kami laging bag. Uh, last year, there was mayonnaise, there was orange and lemons. In the previous years, there was also Parok and Edgar, there was Sponge Cola. So, there were so bands, sikat na bands in the country na we invited namin to play for our bar takers. I was the host that time. Our team namin was Illuminate. Illuminate. <laughs> I'll show you a few clips a bit, so you'll see how we really enjoyed the party. Pagod ko last year. Sobrang daming nangyayari talaga. And sobrang nakakapagod siya. But it's very, very fulfilling. So, early this year, I was chosen to be part of the Dress Up 2020 Aureliano team. And then, eventually, hindi ako nagtuloy to become an oralist. I was supposed to be an oralist, but then hindi ko natuloy. Kasi sabi ko nga, a lot of things happened. And 2020... Wow, de ba? Pero it's the things that are happening right now. Sobrang hindi siya comparable sa nangyari last year, de ba? But I was there to support. I was also part of doing the memorials for the competition. Ayon, congrats lang din sa just sa team namin because qualified to go to Washington. But then because of COVID, di pa de so. But ayon yun. So congratulations. And then after just sa I started working early this year. One of the reasons I wasn't able to compete as well as a dress up. And then after that, conflicts of law again. So I think that's the last time I'm going to compete. We were able to place, again, second place overall. I'm glad na he made that I but proud. Siya yung may ari ng school. And he was so happy na we, again, placed sa conflicts of law. 
Another thing, yung advocacy ko sa LGBT community. I just wanted to be more open about it this year. And thankfully, I was contacted by one of the officers of De La Salle University to make a video with my jaw bells. With my partner, Omega, about the things that are happening to LGBTQ couples, especially here in the country. One of the things that can actually help the community is for people to become aware and to talk about it. The goal actually is just social awareness. We exist. You know, these kinds of couples are normal. They're happy. They're not people who should be looked down upon. So, isa yun sa mga advocacy ko din na gusto ko talaga i-push this year na be able to be more open and more vocal about it. And I hope you guys would understand and, you know, show your support sa community. So, isa pa yun. Early this year, I was also appointed as the chairperson of the Bar Operations. So I'm busy talaga. At the same time, fourth year na rin ako, so yung mga subjects ko review subjects na lahat. And of course, because of this pandemic, and dami talaga nangyari. So maybe I can make another video about my experience sa pandemic. I learned so many things. Alam ko na everybody's struggling. I acknowledge na I'm in a place na of privilege, but I will not ignore the fact that a lot of people are really struggling right now. Always wear your masks and don't go out if you don't need to. Make sure na you're doing everything you can to be safe and to keep the members of your household safe as well. Ayun nga, I have a, quite a big story about COVID sa next video ko. But more or less, yun yung updates ko sa inyo about my life, about law school, what's been happening, the reason na hindi ako nakapag-upload. But I do hope this year I'll be able to upload more videos. And please do comment below if meron kayong suggestions na videos na gusto niyong gawin ko. And also follow my Instagram and Thank you for watching my videos, for continuously supporting my channel. I'm so glad that we have a lot of people, a lot of people, and I hope that we will grow. Pa. And there are many viewers and subscribers because I would really want to share a part of my life with you guys. So I hope that you will be able to Be safe, everyone. Thank you for watching, and see you on my next one. Ooh, ooh.